Crafty Lady Etta. Today we're going to do an awesome project today. So if you like what I do, please subscribe, tap that notification bell, and YouTube will always notify you of all the videos that I upload. Okay? Well, with all this being said, let's get started. Come on. Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Etta. Welcome back. Um, today I'm going to do a, a, a project that just came to mind. Uh, it's something that I thought maybe you all might like to try with me. Um, it's going to be a, a 3D picture. So you're going to need just an old frame or if you want to buy your own frame. This is a frame I already had. It's about 12 by 12 by 12. You're going to need a photograph or you can use a... You don't have to use a photograph if you don't want. But I'm, I'm choosing to use one because I'm going to use this one. Uh, this is one of the Grand Canyon. See? one that I took a long time ago. Um, you, also, you may need some uh, moss. This is just regular moss that I got from Dollar Tree that I've had. You're gonna need some branches. Hold up. You're gonna need some of these branches. These are branches I got from outside. Maybe a rock. I might use a rock in here. I'm gonna use a couple of uh, plants these and remember that ideology that I told you that I, I was doing well I'm going to use these because it's going to be a uh, like a family it's going to be like a family um, 3d picture uh, this is not my family it's just uh, some old photos that I, I have bought off Amazon I'll put it in the description box below where I got this okay I've used these before in some of my other projects. But see, they're just people from a long time ago. And you're going to need some white Waverly paint and maybe some brown paint. I'm thinking of painting this. I'm not sure yet. These? Or I might just leave them natural. Okay, well, with all this being said, let's get started. Okay, guys, you can leave this uh, the color it is, but I want to paint mine white, okay? So I'm just going to start off by painting this white. I may have to do a couple of coats, but that's okay. So we're just going to paint all of this white, okay? It's going, I think it's going to look super cute. I'm going to make it kind of look rustic, okay? Um, I'm letting the, the paint dry a little bit before I put some uh, brown paint on it to give it more of a rustic look and then I'm going to seal it in and then we'll start putting the frame together the rest of the part will be very easy very easy okay okay guys now I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit of brown on here just kind of spread it around make it look a little rustic do it dry brushed, okay? Just do it with a brown.
optional. You don't have to. I'm, I'm kind of like putting some Mud Podge on this to uh, give it a little bit more of a glossy shine. Um, again, this is optional. You don't have to do this. I, I'm doing it because I want to do it. But I'm going to put some of this on the to preserve the paint on the frame. And I'm doing it on this because this is going to be the tree. And I just like it to give it a, a really nice clean look. Just a different look, you know. So yeah. You don't have to do this, but again, it's optional. Okay. Okay guys, now I'm going to put this picture. I'm gonna hot glue it in here like that. The hanging thing is was already on this photo frame so I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of hot glue it in here so it'll stay um, you don't have to do too much just make sure you don't hot glue it in backwards or upside down See how it's coming out? Look. See? And I'm adding branches to make it so I can have a branch where I can sit my people down. So I'm thinking of adding a branch here. I'm just going to put this rock down here. little girl in this right here like that. Uh -oh.
Okay, guys, I'm almost done. I'm just going to put a little bit of uh, moss down here. Just a little bit. Maybe just a teeny weeny little bit over here. Here's the finished product. Thought it came out super cute. I like the way it came out. It's just an idea I had. So I thought I'd do a 3D picture. It would look so nice. It would make a really nice gift. Okay, well, if you like what I do, please subscribe, tap that notification bell, and YouTube will notify you of any and all upcoming videos. And share. And when you tap the notification bell, YouTube will notify you when I upload more videos, okay? Because I have more awesome videos coming. All right, with all this being said, keep on crafting.